आई एम डॉक्टर हमाद जिलानी आई एम वर्किंग एज ए कंसल्टेंट नेफ्रोलॉजी इन नारायण सुपर स्पेशलिटी हॉस्पिटल दिस हॉस्पिटल इज लोकेट इन गुवाहाटी इन द आउटस्कर्ट्स ऑफ गुवाहाटी दिस इज़ वन ऑफ द लीडिंग मल्टी स्पेशलिटी हॉस्पिटल कमिंग टू द नेफ्रोलॉजी सेटअप वी हैव वेरी गुड सेटअप ऑफ नेफ्रोलॉजी हेयर वी डू अराउंड मोर दैन वन थाउजेंड ऑफ दिसमो डायलिस ए मंथ एंड वी आर डूइंग सी ए पी डीज एंड रिसेंटली वी हैव स्टार्ट ट्रांसप्लांटेशन वी हैव डन टू केस ऑफ ट्रांसप्लांटेशन एंड बोथ द पेशेंट्स आर कमिंग इन आवर फॉलो अप दे आर डूइंग क्वाइट वेल सो कमिंग टू द प्रिवेंटिव मेजर्स ऑफ ए किडनी डिजीज which will be help for the general population i will discuss on those methods as we know the kidney disease we divide into two categories one is acute kidney injury and another is chronic kidney disease coming to the chronic kidney disease which is the leading burden of renal disease in our population uh, roughly estimated it is around 850 million uh, 850 patients per million there is the prevalence of this disease in india as per the literature and around 1 lakh 30000 people are requiring dialysis and um, more than 90% of those are not affordable to continue the dialysis in view of poor finances and so it's very important to take the preventive measures so that we cannot land up in this problem so coming to the preventive measures of chronic kidney disease for the general public uh, number one as we know the diabetes and hypertension are the leading cause of chronic kidney disease world over so in the india so once diabetes has been detected or there is a family history of a diabetes we should regularly monitor our blood sugar and keep it in control and similarly hypertension we should uh, regularly monitor our blood pressure and take all the anti hypertensive measures including dietary measures uh, medications healthy lifestyle to control our blood pressure so that it will not subsequently affect our kidneys uh, coming to the diet we should uh, take low salt diet in these cases and uh, we should avoid unnecessarily uh, medications like over the counter medications pain killers herbal remedies and uh, the medicines for gastritis which people usually take ppis and all those medicines over the counter it has been seen that these medicines in the long term lead to the chronic kidney disease so it is better to avoid these medicines or consult a doctor whenever there is a need for these medicines and uh, coming to the other uh, aspect is that we should have a uh, healthy lifestyle healthy lifestyle means that we should do a regular exercise at least 20 minutes a day for 5 to 6 days a week and we should have adequate sleep adequate sleep is that we should have at least 8 hours of sound sleep it has been seen that a sleep deprivation is there this leads to the hypertension which is the second leading cause of chronic kidney disease in our patients and in worldwide